this is Sonia from my happy space welcome back at my channel we are going to do our meditation sheet but unfortunately I have to warn you I don't know what's going on with my phone I do all my recordings on my phone it just says constantly to me my storage is full I have deleted everything I can from my phone I've never had this problem I can't think of that I've done anything differently so I haven't managed to go to a, a mobile shop or cell phone shop just to ask me to help me so unfortunately i can only make very very short videos at the moment it will just to stop and tells me my storage is full so for that reason i'm actually just going to go very briefly over this meditation sheet so we can just quickly get all the information um i just chose the nlt and the american standard version um, this one just says, satisfy us each morning with your unfailing love, for we may that we may sing for joy um, to the end of our life. So that's just um, a different way of saying that. And then the American Standard Version is, oh, satisfy us in the morning um, with, your un for, with your loving kindness instead of steadfast love, that we may rejoice and be glad all our days. And that much difference. The interesting thing, it is written by Moses, um, so that is one of the few psalms that is written by Moses. I think he just maybe wrote another psalm. Um, it is written, obviously, it, it was written to compare God, majesticness, his right to judge the, um, the Jewish nation for because of the disobedient, and comparing that with the short and the futile life we have on earth. Um, there's a few verses that stood out for me. It was obviously this famous verse that, that says, um, All our days pass away under your wrath. We bring our years to an end like a sigh. The years of our life is 70 or even by reason strength 80. And it's comparing um, the fact that, yes, God is so amazing. He's outside time. He is just anything we are not and comparing to the, the shortness of our lives so i could have actually i've done listen to it now i've done a whole study in it but unfortunately as i said I, I can't dare to to talk too long because i'm worried i'm going to cut out so obviously and then to teach us the number of our days that we may get a heart of wisdom return O lord how long have pity on your servant satisfy us in the morning with your steadfast love that we may rejoice and be glad all our days. So basically, the morning can also be early, mean quickly, come quickly. I want to first, that is what I first want to do. And um, obviously, we know the best time, we just know the best time to do our study um, of the Word of God is in the morning, um, when we are fresh and we can start the day. And obviously, we know that the only thing that would really, really going to satisfy our our hearts is the fact that when we dig into the word we are spending time with him we focus on his steadfast love and that will bring us ultimate joy rejoice and gladness all the days of my life it's such a beautiful verse to to um, pray first thing in the morning just to say lord jesus yes i want to be satisfied with you i want to meditate on your steadfast love steadfast love is that constant um, sort of steady love so let's just quickly look at the um what steadfast love it is your loving kindness your good devotion faithfulness your loyal unchanging love and that is the thing that is steadfast now it's not today i'm loving you tomorrow i'm not loving you i'm having that steadfastness um on a daily basis that's what god has for us now satisfy us is also good to me it's to be satisfied continually full to have enough to have plenty your cup is full and that is what it means we will be full satisfied we have, we have plenty if we get our satisfaction from the lord um and then um the word morning um the root word was actually baka which is to inquire to seek and to meditate and that's interesting that the morning was linked to be inquire, seek, and meditate. And that's something we can think of. Maybe the best time to do a Bible study is first thing in the morning. But obviously, there's no right or wrong way. You do when when it is the best for you. But I think if we can do our Bible study in the morning or spending time with the Lord, that's the best time to do it. 
So I'm actually going to leave you now um, with the rest. I've just used, obviously I looked at satisfy, morning, steadfast, love, sing for joy and gladness. That is just generally joy, cheer, happiness, um, cries of joy. That is what we will have when we spend time with the Lord. So I'm sorry for the rust. I'm sorry that it went so quickly. I hope you found it useful and you got lots of gems from this meditation sheet. Um, God bless and I hope to speak to you soon and I'll try to go to a shop as soon as possible to check out what is going on with my phone. <laughs> Please um, give me your prayers. God bless. Bye-bye.